Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all for joining us here today. It is my pleasure to be here with you and to welcome so many representatives of American colleges and universities who share our commitment to bolstering international student mobility, providing access to quality educational experiences, and preparing the next generation of global leaders. Through our combined efforts to internationalize U.S. higher education, we attract more students to our institutions than any country worldwide. When we held the first Education USA Forum six years ago, U.S. campuses welcomed roughly 690,000 international students. But last year, that number grew to 974,000 international students. So we can all be very proud of this number. It is a testament to the great work that we do together. However, we must deepen our commitment to grow student mobility in ways that enhance the quality of students' experiences, both academically and culturally. We must engage international students and ensure their success in our classrooms and welcome them into the fabric of our campuses as valued contributors who offer diverse and essential perspectives that enrich our communities. This gathering here of more than 550 dedicated leaders in the field of international education causes me to reflect on remarks that Secretary Kerry made about the central role that education plays in public diplomacy. He noted the importance of student mobility for our work in foreign policy, calling it perhaps the single most important thing that we do. He said, in country after country that I have visited, where I've had the privilege to meet with the finance minister, an environment minister, foreign minister, prime minister, or even a president, these individuals have taken advantage of programs of exchange during the course of their own education. So it is clear that your campuses prepare international students to assume critical positions of leadership with the global perspectives and intercultural awareness that are vital to developing a more prosperous and secure world. It is also clear that the value of your work is recognized at the highest levels of the United States government. You may have seen in your conference materials that there's a letter from President Obama. President Obama has made international educational exchange and mobility a priority. Like you, he believes in the power of global engagement to help create positive change in the world around us. So I encourage you to help these students integrate into campus life, engage with Americans, and come away with a deeper understanding of our society and people while also sharing their own perspectives with us. It's essential that international students feel they are welcome members of our society while here and that they want to stay connected with us when they return home. So I'd like to thank you for all of the work that you do on behalf of international and American students and for helping to promote US the U.S. higher education community. The strength and diversity of our institutions of higher learning, which is really the basis of Education USA's successes, make them the ideal incubators for ties between the people of all nations. And each one of you plays an important role in making a more informed and inter interconnected world a reality.